Also in Malaysia, there is another unique tradition to celebrate the Lantern Festival Day, which is eating pengat. Pengat is a porridge dessert eaten as a traditional holiday item in the Peranakan culture. It is made with colorful yams, banana, rice cake and coconut milk. Let's take a look. In Taiwan, it is known that one eats glutinous rice rounds for the Lantern Festival, while in Japan, red bean porridge is eaten to ward off disasters. For those in Korea, a multi-grain rice wrapped in lettuce is enjoyed for good luck and prosperity. In Penang, Malaysia, one must eat the dessert bengya during the Lantern Festival as a symbol of peace and harmony for the year. Bengya is a traditional dessert in the Baba Nonya culture. Baba Nonya is a Parnankan Chinese ethnicity defined by the offsprings of the first wave of Chinese settlers who have married local Malaysian women. The males are known as Baba while females Nonya. By combining the Chinese and Malay culture, Bengya eventually became a symbolic dessert to eat during the Lantern Festival. During the Lantern Festival, as a Chinese descendant, we eat Penga. It's a symbolic dessert that the whole family eats after dinner to signal the gathering of the family. The main ingredient is yams of all colors, taro, red yams, purple yams and yellow yams. Those colors make the dish look especially auspicious, and bananas and steamed rice cake is a symbolic of promotions and continuous improvement. Since Lantern Festival is also the Chinese Valentine's Day, so eating something sweet is also symbolic of a lifetime of good relationships. The shape of the ingredients is cut into diamond shape to welcome fortunes and blessings. The dessert Beng Ya and Bu Bu Jia Jia, the Malaysian coconut milk dessert, is similar but not exactly the same. The difference is the inclusion of banana and steamed rice cakes. Bu Bu Jia Jia is a play on words, meaning there's a lot of good ingredients and everything is included. That's why Bubo Cheche has the four yam ingredients. The main distinction is that Beng Yam must include bananas and steamed rice cake. Also, in Baba Nonya society, they use only one particular banana type. In our culture, when we make pengat, we don't just use any type of banana. We'll choose to use the king banana because the aroma of the banana is more fragrant and it tastes smoother and sweeter than others. The colorful banya is filled with many different meanings and perhaps eating a bowl of it on Lantern Festival Day, maybe the singles can find a mate. As we all hope on this day of happiness that those who wish to find a suitable match may do so, and those who already have a match can sustain their blessings.